In this DS5 virtual demo, I will show you how to measure an absorption spectrum using the DS5 spectrophotometer. This is the DS5 touchscreen interface, and to measure an absorption spectrum, I choose Wavelength Scan. In the Wavelength Scan setup, the desired scan parameters are entered. For this sample, I'm going to increase the wavelength resolution by narrowing the slit width to 2 nanometers and reduce the scan range to be between 500 and 300 nanometers. To acquire the scan faster, I'm increasing the scan speed to 1200 nanometers per minute. By swiping left, the display and analysis parameters can be accessed. Here, I'm going to decrease the max value of the absorbance axis to 0.25. This value only affects how the data is displayed and can be changed after the scan is complete. I now have the option to save the scan parameters for reuse later and can give the saved parameters a name. This feature is great if you have a standard set of parameters that you use regularly. These saved parameters can then quickly be loaded later for reuse. To proceed with the measurement, I press continue and acquire the baseline. The baseline is acquired with no sample or reference in the sample chamber and balances the signals of the sample and reference photodiodes. Now that the baseline is complete, I load the solvent-only cuvette into the back reference position and the sample cuvette into the front sample position. Pressing read starts the scan. The wavelength is scanned and the absorption spectrum is acquired and displayed on the touchscreen. The scan is now complete and I can save it by inserting a USB drive into the DS5. The data is saved in an ASCII file format, allowing for easy import to your favourite programs for further analysis and plotting. Files can be saved to either the internal memory of the DS5 or to the USB. Here, I'm choosing to save to the USB only. Previously saved files and methods can be opened by pressing Home and going to Configure, then File Manager. And it's as simple as that. How to measure and save an absorption spectrum using the DS5. Thank you for watching.